to invent, to create. What do you need? Well, That's you right, know. money! You need money if you want to create something that works. It's the world premiere of a play about creative genius and competition. The director is John Henry Davis, and the playwright is 26-year-old Montclair State University graduate Ben Clawson. Thomas Edison seemed like a huge and impossible topic, but uh, I started looking into it and found this particular conflict over ACDC. I want you to repair my dynamos. Very well. The play, entitled The Dangers of Electric Lighting, explores the so-called War of the Currents. He had his direct current, and he went up against George Westinghouse and Nikola Tesla's alternating current. It simply could never be achieved by direct current. Or the man who markets it. Oh, yes. But Edison's darker side resists new technology to protect his interests. Wires with thousands of volts of uncontrollable energy over the heads of our citizens. The alternating current. It, it will not be investigated in my labs. The play was commissioned by Luna Stage, a professional theater committed to creative renewal in the Valley Arts District in Orange, New Jersey. Artistic director Jane Mandel. I love the vision of the Valley Arts District, that arts make community, that arts can really matter in the community. People walk by and they see life. Orange Valley was known as the hat-making capital of the world. It's very theatrical, that, that hat. This is a place where things were made and things were done. Luna Stage is just down the road from Thomas Edison National Park in West Orange, which Detroit-born actor James Glossman visited to prepare for the role. And I grew up going on school trips and saw the Menlo Park Laboratory. He explores the conflict in Edison's character. The part that's the real visionary, wants to improve people's lives, wants to move the world forward, and the part of him that really has a lot invested in being the big guy. My dynamo sparks. My electricity flows through my wires to my bulb. It illuminates. It wasn't just a bulb, it was a whole system. And it was mine. Edison's direct current was soon overtaken by Westinghouse. The world's fair, and I'm going to power it. The whole blasted thing. The biggest AC station yet. But Edison perseveres. He just takes a machete to the jungle and goes through it. And envisions the future use of electric cars. It's the battery batch. The battery for Henry's automobile. He's like a really great baseball outfielder. His mind is running around trying to catch every ball no matter where it gets thrown. To the last minute I'm in the game. Sure, it runs on gasoline now, but this is the first wave, the prototype. You really think it's going to be running on gasoline in 10 years, in 20? Don't be asinine. <laughs> a new human drama on Edison, his rivals, and industrial transformation at Luna Stage in Orange, New Jersey. For New Jersey Arts News, this is Susan Haig.